Hey everybody, it's John from Rad Relics, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how I personally use artificial intelligence to help create very informative eBay listings. It's pretty simple, and I think that once you see how this is done, that you are going to want to incorporate it into your listing processes as well. It really takes a vast amount of the work out of listing, and the AI does the work for you it's absolutely amazing what we're going to do is we're going to switch screens we're going to switch over to my desktop and i'm going to show you how i use chat gtp to help me research the items and then create a informative title that is clickable and then i'm going to show you how i then use that information to have ai create a listing for me that i then can put in to the listing and i will be able to sell these items way faster because I am a neurodivergent individual and I am not really good at that stuff. But AI takes the work out of all the work. So let's get right to it. Before we switch over, I'm going to give you guys a visual example of one of the items that I am going to be using AI to help me list. This is an item that I picked up today. It's definitely a good bolo. If you are out and about and you see uh, certain types of glasses, they really sell good on eBay. And this particular style of glass sells really good this is an aviator these are pretty daggum awesome look how awesome i look these are just freaking gorgeous glasses i paid a whopping 50 cents for these at my getting hole and they are by a company called tasco and it comes with a case world class they are gold toned and they are in great shape so they are beautiful. They sell anywhere between $100 to $150. And these are such great examples of aviator glasses. And I am going to try to get the tip, tip, very top of that price range. So what we're going to do is we're going to switch over screens so that I can access the artificial intelligence interface. And uh, I'm going to show you guys how I personally am able to prompt AI to give me a title, a description, and give me all of the information that I could never, uh, I would never possibly know because I am not artificial intelligence with a vast day. It's so amazing. I mean, I let's just do it. Let's just switch over. I'm excited to show you. Okay, my friends, we have switched over to the chat GTP page. You can access this by going to chatgtp.com. This is the URL right there. And when you get here, there will be the screen similar to this. You can also have a sidebar over here, but I've hidden all of that because it's irrelevant to what we're doing. But you can message chat GTP. It really interacts like you're just talking to another person. You can say hello and it will give you a little prompt it says hey there how's it going great uh thanks for asking i don't know why but i always try to talk to the chat gtp like it's a person and i definitely uh want to create uh, a conversation with this thing so that it feels like that we are buddies but anyways uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to start prompting it to ask it some questions about the item that I have and I am going to say I am looking to list an item on eBay it is a Tasco world class gold tone pair of vintage aviator glasses now this is where you give it some information you let it know all the information that you personally have if there's any numbers on it if there's any measurements anything like that now would be the time to put it in prompt as much information that you can get off of your item and uh, let it know uh, that way it has all of this information to use to build your listing off of. And I definitely want to let the AI bot know that it does come with the uh, glass case. It does include the original case for storage for the glasses. Sorry, I type a little slow. Can you help me create a title? for this item with as close to because you can have up to 80 characters on ebay looks like i spelt that wrong i'm sorry on ebay as close to 80 characters on ebay as possible let's see what it comes up with so sure 
It says Tasco world class uh, world class gold tone aviator glasses with original case vintage. So that gives you your 80 characters. And it says the title is concise. It will include all the key details. Brand Tasco style aviator. The color gold tone. And the inclusion of the original case. It should help attract potential buyers looking for vintage aviator glasses on eBay. Something that I did not include is the fact that the... Um, the lenses are uh, tinted, a dark uh, medium, I don't know, maybe a, a medium, a medium tint. The glasses also have a medium tint to them. Can you create another title? It says, now it says, Tasco World Class Gold Tone Aviator Glasses Medium Tint Original Case Vintage. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go over here and I found something similar. We're going to just hit sell now because we're going to create our own off of this listing and it'll take a minute. So what we're going to do is we're going to put this in there and uh, it, got, it, it is 77 characters long. So that is the title that I am going to go with. And I always use my SKU location. It'll be in... Uh, I'll put it in rolling cart. That's one. That's a cart that I have in the basement that I store small stuff in. And uh, I pick my category. And um, we're going to go down here. They are pre-owned. Now what I need is a description. So what I'm going to ask is, can you create a professional description for my eBay listing that will attract buyers and always be nice to your chat bot so we're going to let it create the listing and as you see here um, it's actually going through and uh, it says enhance your collection with these rare Tasco world-class aviator glasses featuring a timeless gold tone finish a medium tint lens crafted style durability these vintage glasses are uh, complemented by the original protective case ensuring they remain in excellent condition over the years. Whether you're a collector or a fashion enthusiast, these aviator glasses offer a blend of retro charm and practicality. It says the brand is Tasco World Class, style is aviator, color is gold tone. I never like to put gold. I used to work at a hospital and we were describing people's jewelry. We never described it as a precious metal. We would put gold tone. That way people wouldn't be confused that it was actually gold or if it was switched out or whatever. Uh, the lens tint is medium, includes original case for storage. Add a touch of vintage sophistication to your wardrobe or your collection with these iconic aviator glasses. Perfect for everyday wear or a standout piece in your display. They're a must-have for any uh, discerning collector. Don't miss out on the opportunity to own the piece of eyewear history. Condition is excellent vintage condition with minor signs of cosmetic wear. I do not like words like excellent. So what I would do is I would change that word excellent to um, like uh, good because I just I don't like I like to uh, my my philosophy with my eBay listings is I like to uh, under uh, promise and over deliver my pictures will speak for themselves so what I've done here is pasted this in and uh, what I what I can do what you and what you can do is you can say uh, do you know any history about the company and it'll give you uh, some information about the company um, do you know what years they made these type of glasses sometimes it can even help you find out more information it says Tasco has produced various types of glass glasses and optics over the years, including aviator style sunglasses. However, specific information regarding the exact years when Tasco manufactured world class gold tone aviator glasses can be more challenging to pinpoint without access to detailed historical catalogs or company records. So you know, it, sometimes it can help you. Like if I was I was listing a Zippo earlier, and I said Zippo on the bottom of the Zippo there is a 
uh, there is a K and on the other side of the word script Zippo, it says 06. I said, can you use that information to help me date the Zippo lighter to when it was manufactured? And it told me that the Zippo, the K that A through uh, whatever letter would be uh, the, the letter in the alphabet that would go through uh, 12 um, or whatever would uh, dictate the months. That number dictates the month. So uh, K, I believe they said was November and the 06 represented the year that it was manufactured. So I would have never known that. And without a whole lot of research, you can just ask the artificial intelligence these simple questions and it will let you know without scouring the internet, trying to watch YouTube videos and all of this other information. This puts power in the palms of your hand while you're out. You can actually download it to your phone. I have access to it on my phone. I have like a link to this website. So while I'm out, I can actually be using this to help me source, to help find out more about the information of the product that I'm actually looking at so that I can search for pricing and hopefully get a, a better idea of what I'm looking at. If it's a rare item or just a obscure item that you're trying to buy to flip to sell on eBay. And this is how I... I love it. I absolutely love it. Let me know what you think down below. I'm definitely interested in your comments about this. It's just a really quick video wanting to show you guys what I do to create these listings and uh, it's pretty awesome. Okay, folks, here we are back over at our listing screen. We've got our title put in. We've got our bin location. I've got the store category that I'm listing it in. I've got the description here. I've actually priced it at $59.95 and we've got our shipping cost in and all I do now is I go down here and I hit save for later and then what I'll do now in the next step of the listing process is I'll actually take the glasses over to my photo taking station and I will take detailed pictures of the uh, glass case, the glasses and everything and then I will list them and the item will be live it'll be ready to purchase on ebay's site okay guys i've got my photos uploaded and these are the photos and it's definitely a nice pair of glasses i think they should sell pretty quick and due to the ease of using ai i think that it creates a really professional and informative listing and i really believe that somebody is going to come along they're going to see my great photos great title great listing and they are going to buy them because it is definitely summertime and it's aviator sunglass season so i hope you guys enjoyed the video and if you would go down below and hit the thumbs up button and maybe even think about subscribing to the channel we have all kinds of really neat videos that we put out every week talking about buying and selling stuff on eBay and we hope to educate you to become a better seller. So if you do like this video, think about subscribing to the channel. We appreciate you guys for watching and you have a good day and God bless.